If you are a fan of epic battle scenes, futuristic weaponry, and mind-blowing science, then you're in the right place. Rail guns are a revolutionary type of weapon that uses electromagnetic force to launch projectiles at insane speeds. With the potential to exceed Mark 7, these futuristic guns are redefining the way we think about modern warfare and space exploration. Rail guns aren't just for science fiction movies. They're a real technology that's currently being developed by militaries and space agencies around the world. So what is a rail gun? How does it work? And what make it so powerful? Welcome to Best Cool Tech. In today's video, we are discussing the amazing technology that makes up the rail gun. This technology will blow your mind, so stay close. What is a rail gun? A rail gun is a weapon that uses electricity and magnets to shoot a projectile like a bullet or a missile at very high speeds, much faster than traditional guns. It works by passing a large electrical current through two metal rails, which creates a strong magnetic field that pushes the projectile along the rails and out of the gun. Rail guns have the potential to be more powerful and accurate than traditional guns, but they also require a lot of energy and can generate a lot of heat. So, how do rail guns work? Essentially, a rail gun consists of two parallel metal rails and a conductive projectile, such as a metal rod or bullet. When a powerful electrical current is applied to the rails, a magnetic field is created that propels the projectile forward, along the rails and out of the gun. The key to the rail gun's power is the strength of the magnetic field that is generated. By using a high voltage power source and carefully designed rail geometry, the rail gun can generate an incredibly strong magnetic field that can accelerate the projectile to hypersonic speeds in a matter of milliseconds. Rail guns offer several advantages over traditional weapon systems, such as greater range, accuracy, and lethality. However, they also present unique challenges and limitations, such as the need for a large and reliable power source and the potential for significant electromagnetic interference. Despite these challenges, rail gun technology has continued to advance in recent years, and it is now being explored for a variety of military and aerospace applications. Whether you are a science fiction fan or a military technology enthusiast, the world of rail guns is sure to capture your imagination. Let me guess, you're thinking how does the idea of an amazing and fantastic technology come to reality, right? Let's look into its history. Rail guns may sound like something out of a science fiction movie, but their development and history are very much grounded in reality. The concept of using electromagnetic force to launch projectiles dates back to the early 20th century. But it wasn't until the 1970s that researchers began seriously investigating the potential of rail guns for military and aerospace applications. One of the earliest pioneers in rail gun technology was the American physicist Richard Post, who in the 1960s and 1970s conducted groundbreaking research on the subject. He developed the first laboratory-scale rail guns and demonstrated that they were capable of accelerating small projectiles to incredibly high speeds. In the following decades, railgun technology continued to develop and mature. In the 1980s, the US Navy began investing heavily in railgun research, recognizing the potential of the technology to launch projectiles at hypersonic speeds over long distances. By the 1990s, the Navy had developed a prototype railgun capable of firing projectiles at speeds of over 7,000 miles per hour, making it one of the most powerful weapons of its kind. Since then, railgun technology has continued to advance, with researchers exploring new materials, designs, and applications for the technology. In recent years, railguns have been proposed for use in a variety of military and aerospace applications, including anti-ship and anti-aircraft defense systems, satellite launchers, and even spacecraft propulsion. Despite their potential, Railguns still face a number of technical and practical challenges that must be overcome before they can be widely deployed. These include the need for large amounts of electrical power to operate, the generation of high levels of heat and electromagnetic interference, and the potential for damage to the rails and other components due to the extreme forces involved. 
Nonetheless, the history and development of railgun technology have shown that it is a promising and exciting field that has the potential to revolutionize military and aerospace technology in the coming years. The Military and Defense Applications of Rail Guns Rail guns have been a topic of interest in military and defense circles for quite some time. These electromagnetic guns are known for their high muzzle velocities and extreme precision, which make them ideal for a variety of military applications. One of the most compelling benefits of rail guns is their ability to fire projectiles at hypersonic speeds, potentially exceeding Mark 7. This means that they can hit targets from long distances with unparalleled accuracy, making them an attractive option for long-range engagements. Also, rail guns have a very high rate of fire and can be reloaded quickly, making them ideal for rapid response situations. They are also relatively quiet and emit very little heat, which makes them difficult to detect by enemy forces. Rail guns are often compared to other electromagnetic launch systems, such as coil guns and mass drivers, due to their similarities in function and design. While all three systems use electromagnetism to propel objects forward, there are some key differences between them. Coil guns, for example, use a series of electromagnetic coils to accelerate a projectile, rather than the two parallel rails of a railgun. They're often simpler and less expensive to build than railguns, but they're also less efficient and can't achieve the same level of velocity as a railgun. Mass drivers, on the other hand, use a linear motor to accelerate a projectile along a track. They're often used for launching payloads into space, but they're also used in some military applications. While they can achieve higher velocities than coil guns, they're not as efficient as rail guns and are often more complex to operate. When it comes to comparing these systems, it's important to consider factors such as velocity, efficiency, cost, and ease of use. Rail guns, for example, are capable of achieving extremely high velocities and are often more efficient than other electromagnetic launch systems, but they're also more complex and require a significant amount of power to operate. So, which electromagnetic launch system is the best? The answer depends on the specific application and the priorities of the user. But one thing is for sure, whether it's a rail gun, a coil gun, or a mass driver, the power of electromagnetism is truly awe-inspiring. Rail guns are a cutting-edge technology that has the potential to revolutionize the way we think about weapons and their impact on the environment. When compared to traditional weapon systems, rail guns offer a number of economic and environmental benefits that make them an attractive option for militaries and governments around the world. One of the main advantages of rail guns is their efficiency. Unlike traditional firearms that use gunpowder to propel bullets, rail guns rely on electricity to generate the magnetic force needed to launch projectiles. This means that rail guns are more energy efficient and produce less waste than traditional weapon systems. Additionally, rail guns require fewer moving parts, which reduces the risk of mechanical failure and the need for frequent maintenance. Rail guns also have a significantly reduced environmental impact when compared to traditional weapons. Conventional weapon systems often use toxic chemicals such as lead, copper, and brass, which can be harmful to both humans and the environment. In contrast, rail guns use inert materials like metal or plastic for their projectiles, which are much safer and more environmentally friendly. From an economic standpoint, Rail guns can be a more cost-effective solution than traditional weapon systems. Because rail guns require less maintenance and fewer replacement parts, they can save governments and military significant amounts of money over time. Additionally, the reduced environmental impact of rail guns can help to avoid costly cleanup and remediation efforts associated with traditional weapon systems. Rail guns offer a number of compelling economic and environmental benefits that make them a promising technology for militaries and governments around the world. As research and development in this field continue, it is likely that we will see even more innovative and sustainable uses for railguns emerge in the years to come. Railgun technology has the potential to transform the world of weapons and their impact on the environment. Which would you rather face? Traditional weapon systems or the railguns technology system? Comment down below.
If you liked this video, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button so you don't miss out on more best cool tech. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more.